Hey there, pretty people. Welcome to the release of Resolume 7.17. Recording is getting a complete overhaul in this update, making it much more powerful. You can now quickly copy and paste effects, grab an image from your monitors, and we have added a couple of new handy shortcuts to wire. So grab a cup of something, sit down, relax, and let me tell you all about it. Recording got an overhaul in Resolume 7.17. The record button is gone and has been replaced with its own dedicated panel. The panel is visible in the default layout but can also be accessed through the view menu. In the record panel you find a whole suite of new options when recording. Firstly, you can now select what you want to record. Besides the composition, you could be recording a dedicated layer, a group or even a screen. From now on you can tell Arena what to do after recording. You can place the recorded video onto an empty clip or simply store it onto your computer. The preset section has been expanded to include presets with the H.264 codec. This codec is hardware accelerated and allows you to record for as long as you want. And as cherry on the cake, you can use the start and stop settings to change the behavior of the record button. You can start recording upon hitting the record button or arm it to start when you trigger a clip. Besides manually stopping the recording, it is now possible to stop after a given time or after a predefined amount of beats. This next feature should help you speed up your workflow. You can now copy effects from your composition, layer, group or clips to anywhere else. Simply right click on the origin and select copy effects. Then right click on the target and select paste effects. All effects will be copied to the target, including all animations and settings. In Resolume 7.16, we added a feature to Resolume Wire that allows you to grab an image from a monitor. We really liked this feature, so we ported it over to Arena and Avenue. To copy the monitor as an image, you navigate to the cogwheel icon underneath the monitor and select Copy Image. With that copy on your clipboard, you could paste it onto an empty clip or send it over WhatsApp to your mom. The Akai APC Mini MK2 is quickly becoming a new favorite controller for Arena and Avenue. But the default buttons were not very bright. We have fixed this in Resolume 7.17. The buttons are always max brightness. No need to set it to drum mode anymore. Just plug and play. Resolume Wire received a couple of small updates this release as Arena and Avenue were our main focus. So let me take you to a little wire whirlwind with all the new features. We have added two new math nodes, Replace NaN and Distance. Replace NaN lets you, well, replace NaN in any signal with a given value. The Distance node lets you calculate the distance between two vectors. On to the shortcuts. We have added a pack shortcut. Select two, three or four nodes that produce a float and hit Command P to pack them into the correct float type. Two floats will create a float two, three floats will create a float three, and you get the deal. We have also added a comment shortcut. Command M will create a comment node at the center of your current view. Very simple, but there is a little trick included. Select a couple of nodes and hit the Command M shortcut. Wire will now create a hollow comment node around the selected nodes. I can hear you scream. So many awesome shortcuts. Can we please have one more? Sure you can. Command A is used to select all nodes in a patch. This is common knowledge. But you can now use Command Shift A to select all unused nodes in your patch. This is really useful when you have a big patch and you want to do some quick cleanup. Wire considers all nodes that are not contributing and are not connected to the final output of the patch as unused. And that was all for this update. I hope you are ready to get recording. Feel free to drop any questions in the comment section below and we'll see you soon.